Okay, dear students, let us see what is there in this question. The diagram below shows four energy levels for the atoms of a gas. The diagram is drawn to scale. The wavelengths of the photons emitted by the energy transition are shown below. Lambda 1, lambda 2, 3, 4. What are the wavelengths of the spectral lines emitted by the gas in order of decreasing frequency? Okay, so a bit confusing. They're talking about the wavelength also and the frequency also, but don't worry. So lambda 1, lambda 2, lambda 3 is just for the sake of uh, telling, like which transition are you talking about? But we have to arrange this uh, these energies into the order of decreasing frequency it means decreasing energy so decreasing frequency means that the energy gap should be decreasing so what is the biggest energy gap you do, do you see here lambda 4 so lambda 4 is biggest and then lambda 1 clearly and then lambda 2 and then lambda 3 so lambda 4 lambda 1 lambda 2 lambda 3 b is the answer for this question so it's completely straightforward don't get confused about it uh, the concept that i have used here what is it that the energy which is liberated is it can be written as e is equal to h nu or it can be written as h c by lambda so uh, uh, the more is the frequency more is the energy so it says that we want to have decreasing order of frequency so more frequency to lesser frequency means more energy to lesser frequency lesser energy more energy is clearly available here because it's talking about lambda 4 the gap more is the gap more is the energy simple and this is how we do this question i think the explanation uh, that i have given you here is um, enough to understand this even even then, if you feel any problem, like you are not able to understand something, please do mention that in the comment section, okay? I think like energy gap is giving you the total change in energy and that is directly related with the frequency and it is decreasing order of frequency means decreasing order of energy and we have just seen the diagram, which energy is big, which energy is lesser, arranged it accordingly. So the answer is B. Let us see the mark scheme if the answer is B in the mark scheme or not. And clearly the answer is given as B. So this is how we do this question, my dear student. This is Professor Varun. All the best. Bye.